to NTC Training. Thank you for joining us. Today I'd like to talk to you about healthy plumbing. Ladies and gentlemen, the best way to describe healthy plumbing to you is to tell you a story. Many, many years ago, when I joined the plumbing industry, I was called out to a house in Parkhurst, Johannesburg. On arrival at the house, I was told to fix the leaking faucets. While I was fixing the faucets, I noticed that the pan connect on the toilet was leaking. And below the toilet, they put this two-liter ice cream bowl, which was collecting the dripping every time they flushed the toilet. But I could also smell in the bathroom. It had that old bathroom musty smell, real shitty smell. Nonetheless, when the client came past, I said to him, ma'am, we need to repair this pan connector because on certain days, Methane could escape from this leaking pan connector into the house and it could make somebody feel nauseous or give you migraine. Because methane is odorless, colorless and tasteless, you cannot smell it, you cannot know it's there until it's too late. She said to me, well, come with me, let me go and show you something. So I said, oh, alright, fine. Off we went down the passage. I thought to myself, oh, shit lady, where are we going now? We got to the bedroom, she ripped open the cover door. There they were, pink, red, all the colors in the rainbow, tablets, lined up in her cupboard, rows and rows of tablets. I said, you know, I've had a migraine for the past few years, and I have been to doctors, I have had CAT scans, I have been sent to specialists, nobody can find the problem. They've told me to go and leave, they've told me it's stress, they've told me I need to break, I've done all that, migraine still persists. I said, ma'am, let me seal the pan connector, I can't tell you that is 100% the problem, let's seal it and see what happens. Nonetheless, I sealed the pan connector, finished off the job, left the house, and that was it. A week later, I get a phone call. Sobbing lady, crying her eyes out. I said, ma'am, what's the problem? She says, no, she just wants to tell me something. I said, what's the problem, ma'am? Please tell me. She says, you know, the afternoon after you left, after repairing the pan connector at my house, my migraine subsided. You know, it's now five days. It hasn't come back. Not at all. I haven't had any pulls. Nothing. Migraine gone. She said, it must have been the pan connector that was leaking into my house, letting the methane in. I did not know it was there. And this was causing my headaches and causing my life to be a nightmare. So I said, well, ma'am, I told you it could be a cause. Let's fix it. We fixed it. Problem solved. She says, I would like to tell you something else. I said, what's that, ma'am? She said, you know, I've tried everything. I've tried the doctors, the pills, the remedies, the, the leave, the stress, the everything I've done. I've done everything people can, told me to do. I've done it never took away the headache. You came along, fixed the pan connector in my house, and my headache's gone. Said, yes, ma'am. She says, I would like to tell you something else. I said, what's that, ma'am? She says, if you had not solved the problem that day by fixing the pan connector, I was planning on divorcing my husband. So you saved my marriage as well. Said, Thank you, ma'am. Nonetheless, ladies and gentlemen, what I'd like to tell you is, Healthy plumbing means we need to make sure that the pan connectors, the P-traps, the S-traps, all these funny traps that we in plumbing make, the plumbers design your house to have these traps in to stop the bad odors and airs from coming back into your house, which could cause great problems, could affect your health tremendously. Let's thank you for that. And in my next video clip, I will be doing geezers, plumbing codes and regulations, and many more videos to come. And on that note, I'd like to say thank you. Goodbye.